to our next story. So moving away from uh, floods, uh, you know, it was a week ago um, and it surely has been dominating headlines here and internationally. But how about the story of a man who walked from Dubai to Riyadh hoping to meet his idol, Ronaldo. I love this so much. <laughs> He is a massive Cristiano Ronaldo superfan. Uh, Kevin KP just rocked up in Riyadh after trekking all the way from Dubai. That's right. He walked a whopping 1,200 kilometers across uh, the beautiful desert in the hopes of meeting his idol. It took him 36 days of pure sweat and determination to pull it off. And we think that is pure dedication. Now, Servants, a.k.a. at the underscore, their underscore footer, underscore official, is a cross-country walker who has previously walked Kerala to Kashmir, a total of 3,200 kilom- kilometers back in 2021. But his mission begs the question, how far would you go to meet your superheroes? How far would you go, Casey? Well, the question, mm, who is... my superhero that I would do that for. I love the, how long did it take him? 36 days? Like if you have 36 days of pure solitude, because he did this alone. Mm -hmm. I think I would walk, no. No. Um, For a family member, I would do that. Yeah. But I don't think, I don't think I have like pure celebrities that I idolize to that point. But I I get it. Yeah. And I get that some people look at Cristiano Ronaldo like, uh, you know, he's, He's not just a footballer. He is a machine. He is dedicated. He's passionate. He's put everything to it. And there's there's many reasons to be a fan for him. I do this for family. I mean, if I, there was a reason. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I, look, the thing is, honestly, I feel like um, to every person, they have their own. Uh, yeah, I would do this to that person, but I wouldn't do this to that person. Yeah, sure. You know what I mean? But um, for me, I, I don't know. Like, like for, for me, I would... I would not do it for, for no one. I would not do it because I am, I, yeah, I, would, I love walking. I love working out and so on. But walking for 36 days, I mean, I will need rest. I will need to go back. I will need AC. I will need all of the things that, you know, like we do get. So We should know that Kevin yeah. is a cross-country walker. Um, yeah. Did I add it? So he's walked, uh, as you said, from Kashmir to Kerala. So this is something that, you know, he loves to do and he's passionate. So why not put your two passions together? Meet your idol. Super fun. Um, hmm? And meet your idol. And meet your idol. And you can actually see this video, which I love. He's outside. Oh, I'm going to say the wrong football club, and I'll be, I'll, I'll be uh, fired from my job. Oh, it's a halal. I was going to say yeah. al Nasser. Yeah. It's no, al halal. Yeah. Okay. So he's outside <laughs> the correct. football club that a lot of plays for in Saudi <laughs> and he got to see him that's amazing I mean you know for sure it was I mean it would have been devastating if he hadn't seen Ronaldo I mean if I was him and I walked like that much distance to see Ronaldo and that much took me that much time and I hadn't seen Ronaldo I would be I, I would throw a temper tantrum <laughs> I would, for, uh, yeah, I would throw a temper tantrum, but lucky him. <laughs> You're Literally. alone. No one's going to hear you. Yeah, I mean, yeah, uh, it's fine. It's uh, okay. I look, would, he like, looks like such a nice guy. I think fair play to him. I think uh, he loves walking and he got, he walked the whole way to Saudi. What a, what a mission, what a feat. And like, I think, you know, walking is one of these things that it's it's good for the mind. It's good for the soul. It's good for the body. Um, the more we do of it, the better. 100%. So why not? I agree with you. Maybe just walk. I'll walk under my house. So. <laughs> I'm just imagining you outside like a football club in Saudi throwing a huge temper <laughs> trap. You're like, where's Ronaldo? I'm like, ah, where is he? Why is Ronaldo not here? Does he not know I'm coming? Um, although we should point out that Ronaldo has been spending some time in Abu Dhabi. He's opened a restaurant there. Uh, himself and Georgina had a beautiful weekend not too long ago. So... There is the possibility that if you don't want to walk the whole way to Saudi, you might be able to walk to Abu Dhabi and catch him I mean, there. I mean, I, he's not like... He's not for you. <laughs> he, he's not for me. You know, I, I'm, I'm not a very football girl, <laughs> to be honest with me you. Either. Yeah, well, maybe I would... No, actually, I wouldn't walk for anyone, so... <laughs> Sorry, I take that 